Hi guys, join me and let's cook this pamno soup. Nigerians call it banga. So Australia, we don't have the palm food here. And then we have this cream one. If you go to any African shop, it is there. So you just pick one and then you start preparing it. So my husband has been asking me to prepare this soup for a very long time, but there was no time, guys. My schedule would not allow me. So this day I went to church and then there was time so I decided to cook this as you can see I miss my um, my uh, palm cream with hot water and I added my stock fish in my pot and then add it put it on fire for it to cook a little bit as you can see I'll just remove everything in there I sprinkle a little bit of onion yeah that's what I was taught back home and I added my tomatoes as well and add a little bit of onion I added my frozen peppers as well and then I added more of hot water for it to help me to cook it on time I put it on fire at this time it's boiled the kitchen was actually busy there's still there are many things on it so I have to bring it here to be putting the other stuff <laughs> somebody came to visit us and we were playing music at the background <laughs> And we were both <laughs> dancing together. It was such a fun. This family are so lovely. It's, I just, when they come around, it's a whole vibe. And then, yeah, we we're just having fun. My husband just came to the kitchen, as so you can see him there. He assisted me to wash my dishes. He's just a lovely person. Yeah, I love him for that. He does a lot. So at this time, I brought the soup from the fire. And then added my goat meat inside. Okay, I prepared this ones down so that yeah, everything will be quick for me as well. That's a sprinkle splash rather. I put it on fire and then grounded my um, all those things that I removed from the soup the tomatoes onion and pepper i blended everything and then i added it as you can see the soup is just cooked you know um niger like their banga to be uh, more thicker <laughs> but we got this we don't know we don't like it like that if you want to take it means we are using it to eat something different but every banga or pump soup we add is thick at this i add a spinach and then dry scent leaf as well I don't know, but my mother and I say it will come out, so I just added it, okay, for them. Guys, guess what? This soup I did not finish, so I have to continue the next day, <laughs> which is today. Okay, so I just put it on fire, allow it to cook, for us to get a little bit um, thicker, okay? And then I added my crayfish and my um, Maggi stock as well or um, Maggi I just added that one to mix it allow it to cook a little bit and then I off it I don't know how you prepare your banka but anyway that is one of the way I prepare banka when it comes to my husband okay, because I have to meet his culture this time the soup is ready thanks for watching guys